I just got engaged. <laughs> Lily Collins is a glowing bride-to-be. The Emily in Paris star shared new details about her recent engagement to boyfriend Charlie McDowell when she virtually stopped by Live with Kelly and Ryan this week. Charlie popped the question during the couple's recent road trip to New Mexico and Arizona. And while Lily had no idea the big moment was coming, she didn't have any questions about Charlie being the one. I, I was very surprised as to when and where it would happen, but it was kind of one of those situations where I knew the second that I met him that I wanted to be his wife one day, and so uh, it was just a matter of when, really. <laughs> Lily said Charlie told their loved ones about his proposal plans ahead of time, but successfully kept the secret from her hiding a carefully set up camera to capture the special moment. It was all very much pre-planned and, uh, and he did a self-timer video, which we were then able to later get screen grabs, but um, he set the whole thing up without, without me knowing, obviously. He presented her with quite a unique ring, which Lily proudly showed off to Kelly and Ryan. Um, it's a, it's a rose-cut diamond. Okay, um, so those... And Charlie designed it with Irene Newer, so I was very, very surprised by it. And um, But it's exactly what I would have wanted, and he knew me so well, obviously. Lily is already loving having the rock permanently on her finger. Earlier this week, she snapped this selfie with it in frame and wrote, My new favorite accessory. While Lily is on cloud nine, Charlie seems to be just as happy. In his post announcing their engagement, he wrote these swoon-worthy words. In a time of uncertainty and darkness, you have illuminated my life. I will forever cherish my adventure with you. On top of their engagement, Lily and Charlie have something else special to celebrate. Lily's brand new series, Emily in Paris, is set to debut on Netflix October 2nd. Access Hollywood recently talked to her all about the show and what it was like to work with Sex and the City costume designer, Patricia Field. How? awesome is it to have her there to bring all of these looks to life oh my god are you kidding me i have admired patricia for years she's an icon um and she's a total genius at what she does she allows clothing to be an ex extension of a character's personality um and so for me there's no one better to help with emily uh, she was an amazing collaborator as well she genuinely asked for my advice and opinions and thoughts and feelings about all the um, all the looks. And so we really got to play around together and um, she's a character herself and I love her so much. So it was a dream come true to get to collaborate with her. I pulled a couple of photos from your Instagram because the envision here, this is so beautiful. I know she was saying- oh. When you get to put something on like this and she has that inspiration of Audrey Hepburn and you're wearing this and people get to see this, what are the emotions? Oh my God, every emotion. When she showed me the, the, the iconic image that she's like, I was thinking we go along these lines. I was like, as someone who loves Audrey Hepburn and I think Emily also loved Audrey Hepburn. Um, for me, it was to, to, to couple that with actually shooting in the Parisian Opera House, the Paris Opera House. It's like, what a, what a dream. I mean, we got access to be able to shoot there throughout the night. I'm running around the halls, looking at the amazing murals and architecture and hotel slippers and that outfit. And I'm going, what is this? And especially now thinking back on it when all we want to do is travel and it's just, it's not possible. And so the nostalgia of, um, of thinking back to that was, is so special. And um, yeah, what, it's a pretty iconic moment for me to remember.